Hey guys, so breakaway and minimum features. A ring came past my desk today, which is a perfect example of uh, the engraving. is beautiful. You can see there's no breakaway. What, what we mean by breakaway is the hollow inside the writing gets filled in with material. All right, because inverted in powder, this metal comes rushing through here. And if this writing is too deep, it breaks away. The, the, the pieces of engraving, the powder, and they go flying around the casting, all right? There's an example of that happening in the top here. That didn't happen with this text. It's all good, all right? So B love C, 8, 3, 24, whatever that is. But then have oh, a look on the top. Have a look on the top here. You can see this kind of porosity here. So customers will tell you that this no, is porosity. Like, you know, see that? So porosity is round. Porosity is bubbles. There is never square porosity. All right, that's just physics. So for this to be here means a piece of powder came from somewhere else. All right, and you can literally see where it came from right next to it. See there? There's meant to be a hole through the ring. So look at this in reverse. Imagine that this was burnt away inside of a casting flask. All of this is hollow, and the metal has to come flying in here. What used to be here before was a very thin little rectangle of powder running across the ring in that direction to exit as a hole on this side. We got lucky on this side, it worked. On this side, when the metal came flying in, into this cavity, it broke off that little square of powder that used to be running across the bottom here. It kind of turned sideways because it's a lower density than the gold. It sat against the edge of the, the wall and the metal flowed around it. And then so this is called breakaway. All right, and again, God doesn't make square bubbles. Nobody makes square bubbles. So whenever you see something that's not round, it's not porosity. All right. We also have more of it over here. Again, not round. Can you see over there? Little square sections. Probably means a little bit of powder from here broke away somewhere. And there I see another one there. All right. So this is a weird... Ah, I see where it came from. You can actually see it there. There used to be a very thin little bit of powder over there. It's kind of broken away, flying around the ring. So if we look at the other side... See that? Here's a piece that broke out. It looks from it looks like it broke out from there and came lying against the side of the ring here. All right, so our CAD and our CAM team send out minimum specifications on their emails. Then the customers just ignore the minimum specifications and send us this. This is truly a weird one because the customer did follow the minimum specifications for engraving, but not for minimum feature in the ring. And so then this is now going to be a miscast. Um, I'm going to try to record this video slightly more professionally. We're going to give it to the CAM team to start sending out to customers, going like, this is this is kind of your reward for drawing features that are too small. Um, and then hopefully we can put uh, we can get rid of some of this in our in our cycle. In this video, I'm going to share with Alan for the sales team, and we'll do a little prezo on it a bit later. But yes, so that's breakaway. Perfect, perfect ring to explain it. Thanks, guys.